Arm the aircraft with the left stick, pushing it to the bottom right. The arms fold out. Now increase the throttle with the left stick to take off. We accelerate the aircraft with the right stick, pushing it forward. And you can see the copter does not have to lean forward. It does not have to pitch forward because it has the thruster motor in the rear. So it can stay perfectly flat while accelerating. Flying a left curve here with the left stick, maintaining height and accelerating with the right stick. And now pushing up with the left stick, flying a right curve, mostly with the right stick. Dropping down and then forward and up over the camera with both sticks. Up again with the left stick. Now flying up only with the left stick. Centering it then to maintain the altitude and then pushing it to the right for a yaw for rotation around its own axis. Here the onboard view. Flying straight, just with the right stick, using the left stick only to maintain altitude. Now we're flying a curve with both stick, yawing and rolling at the same time. Just flying straight here with the right stick. Yeah, using the left stick here for a yaw around the own axis, then we accelerate with the right, flying the left curve with both sticks, increasing the altitude a little bit, dropping down again with the left stick, yawing left now, flying toward the camera with the right stick, and another left curve with both, with both sticks, and we're gonna drop down a little bit, fly straight by the camera, and as we come by, we're going to use the right stick, pull it backwards, pull it down to slow the aircraft down. Here another landing, using the left stick to drop the throttle on the VTOL motors, and once we touch down, the throttle goes all the way down, and the left stick to the bottom left to disarm the aircraft and fold the arms in. Thank you for watching.